in and out. Fast rocket here. Uh, look, here's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be testing stevia because I love to use it in my coffee, but I don't know for a hundred percent fact whether or not it spiked my insulin or not. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to test it. I hope it doesn't. I stopped using it back in the summer because I went on a, a very serious fasting program and I didn't want to make, I didn't know for sure. I said, okay, when we start Fast Rocket, I'm going to test it. It's actually the first thing I'm testing, stevia. Let's see if my body has an insulin response to it. I'll test it at 30 minutes, I'll test it at an hour, and I'll test it at two hours. But first, to get a baseline, we need some blood right now. Let's go. Now, listen while I tell you, I put some MCT oil in there because I'm doing this testing and it's gonna just bridge me from now at 16 hours to 18 hours when I start my uh, fasting, my feeding window at 2 p.m. So I threw some uh, MCT oil in there because it is insulin neutral and it's good for you. And it gets right into your bloodstream, it gives you energy, and it tells your brain, hey, everything's cool. Let's, uh, let's make some more ketones. So what I anticipate happening here, what I anticipate is that my ketones will go up at the end of two hours and my sugar will stay about the same. Maybe drop a little bit. Let's enjoy this coffee. Oh yeah. Hmm. Cheers. Oh man, that's so good. It's so good. We'll see if it spikes my sugar. Uh, I hope it doesn't. But if it doesn't, I'm going to be a happy camper. If it does, I'm going to be a happy camper. Because I always find things to be happy about. What about you? See you in a bit. Rest exactly as I said it would happen. Isn't that cool, beans? All right, so we started out at 89, and then we had the stevia with the coffee. 30 minutes after that, it went to 87. An hour, it went to 81. And at two hours, it went to 81, as what it stayed at 81, essentially. But what's interesting is the ketones went from 0 0.7 to 1.3. I am a happy camper. Well, you know, I don't think I could be any more excited about this than I am. This is awesome. You see, I had always taken my coffee with, with this uh, sweetener, uh, Stevia. And then it, when I got the idea to do Fast Rocket, I realized that in order to do this properly, I had to test everything that I put in my body just so that I would know what kind of insulin response it would have. And so as, as today is the first day officially of Fast Rocket, although it's been four years in the making, uh, the one thing that really, really I feel so, I don't know, deprived is I just don't like black coffee. I like it a little sweet. And the only sweetener that is really allowed on keto or fasting is, is stevia. And I've always been told that it didn't raise your blood sugar. 
didn't create an insulin issue, but I didn't know it for fact. So I'm pretty excited. Today's a good day uh, because I found out today for a fact, for truth, that stevia in my coffee in the morning does not create any kind of insulin response in my body. That is huge. Maybe it'll be the same for you. Thank you for watching Fast Rocket. I look forward to sharing my story with you.